Hello everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Agman. I'm going to start with one question actually. We got so many questions about this. This is about DV Lottery actually. It's going to be for 2021 and then uh, the people are going to be able to apply. Applicants are going to be able to apply for the 2021 DV Lottery this year starting October which is next month. And we got so many questions because uh, the, our followers are kind of concerned and they're asking, oh, what are the rules? Like we heard that there are some changes to current DV filing. So what are those changes? Could you tell us? They're asking us. So what I could tell you is that the U.S. State Department actually announced two changes to the diversity visa program, which is also known as Green Card Lottery. In these changes, right, which uh, it was announced in the Federal Registry, the State Department it explicitly states that individuals who enter uh, the lottery but not provide all the required information will be disqualified from the lottery for that fiscal year. So you have to understand that. That means if you are applying for DV lottery this year, when you're applying, you want to make sure even if you're as a principal applicant or as a derivative applicant, right? If you're a principal applicant and including your wife and kids, you want to make sure that you actually add correct full names, date of birth, place of birth, and then, uh, you know, the proper required a digital photo uh, and also so the information that required and those information needs to be correct otherwise you will be disqualified it will be mandatory disqualification from the DV you know, lottery applications another thing is the State Department would also require all petitioners to have a valid non-expired passport at the time of the entering the lottery so this is interesting you have to understand this is a big change because previously a passport was only needed at the green card uh, appointment stage uh, for those actually who won the lottery basically first you have to win the lottery and then you won you apply for DS you know a form and then once you schedule at the US consulate at that time you actually had to have a proper or valid passport but now and this with this new change applicants have to have actually this passport valid unexpired passport at the time of applying for the dv lottery so basically of course the state department trying to make sure that there's no fraudulent activities and that's what they're trying to make sure that the people have a you know valid one but i could tell you this though one other thing that we receive questions about is what will happen if as a principal applicant if i have to have a passport valid how about my wife? How about my kids that I'm going to add into my application? So it's only that you are the person, whoever is the one applying for the DV lottery application, that person is only the one needs to have the valid unexpired passport. But their derivative, which is, such as wife or kids, they don't have to have a valid passport at the time of that you're filing for the DV lottery. Unless, of course, your wife is also applying, so that means she also have to have a passport. Basically, this will become important, and I kindly warn the or followers to make sure that they have a valid passport uh, by next month, otherwise they're not going to be able to uh, actually get a chance to apply for DV lottery. Mm -hmm.